I remember the Honorable Elijah Muhammad saying, Savior's Day, 1974. He said, Allah says to us, if you don't like any ugly thing about yourself, he will cause you to grow into a new growth. The things that Allah would like to do now and will do is destroy the works of the devil, as the devil would like to destroy God's work, which God has created. He said, the things that Allah would like to do now is destroy the works of the devil. Now, I just want to share one thing with you. You know, there's a lot of talk going around about these young people in the hip hop generation saying, we're calling each other niggas. And it's upsetting a few people who remember the past when white people used that as a derogatory term against us. But if you would, older people, and I'm older people, consider this. Is not Allah destroying the works of the devil by putting this word out here and making it mean something else? That's destroying the works of the devil because originally we didn't call ourselves niggas. He called us niggas. So now we're taking that same word and we're identifying the works of the devil. We're bringing it up loud, okay? Just want to share a few things with you. Want you to start having a better thought about the creation. Because nothing has happened that wasn't already, you know, explained. Allah has been in control ever since he found us and called us the lost found nation of Islam in the wilderness of North America. When he gave to us a flag, star, and crescent, sun, moon, and star, representing our independence as a nation, whether any of you accepted it or not, you're still a part of it. Whether you agree or disagree with the Honorable Elijah Muhammad, you're still a part of it. If you are a black man in America, if you are a so-called American Negro. The main thing which I keep mentioning enough to make you disgusted is something for the black man in America who has spent his life long in sleeping in ignorance of the knowledge of that which he is in. But as soon as the black man can awaken to the knowledge of this that he is in, then he can lay hold to that which he did not have knowledge of, which is that the black man is the creator of the first creation. Allah wants to put the black man back in power, and the way the black man can be put back into power is that Allah has to make the black man all over again to master the power after giving the black man the authority. We've been given the authority. Now, what I'm trying to share with you is the power. 